Hey, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm gonna be talking to y'all about this unit. This unit right here. B bitch, you're, stop. I'm not trying. Okay, if you wanna see that, keep on watching. This is the unit I received from Yalissa Hair. Um, it is color 27. This is the color that I love to get my units in because it's that perfect blonde brown that I love to try to get that I've never successful with. So I'm really happy that it already came that color so I don't have to do any coloring. I'm not going to show you guys that process because I'm literally just washing and I'm not. It's already a blonde unit so there's no need to, you know, um, bleach anything. So I'm just, um, I'm probably going to get this highlights later, but I'm just going to um, wash her and... Yeah, I'm just gonna wash her and come back with it on, I believe. I don't know if I'm gonna do an install video and I don't know if I'm gonna do a tweezing clip, but I am just gonna wash it and I'll be back, period. All right, I'm back, you know, voiceover teams, but now I'm just, excuse you. Now I'm just adjusting the wig to my head, making sure that it fits me correctly um, because I do have quite a dome, do have quite a head. So I have to cut it and make sure it fits me and it's no portion for my head. So right now I'm cutting the ear flaps out. I just pull it down. Try not to pull it too far, but I just pull it down, see where the ear is gonna need to be cut, cut it, and then go from there. Um, make sure you don't cut this too high because you can always add, you can always cut more, you can never cut less. So if you cut too much, that's too bad. If you don't cut enough, you can always go back and cut more. Um, now I'm using my lace glue. I've never used bold hold before this video. Here comes me on and crappy already how it goes. Ah! I've never used bold hold before this video. I'm not really a fan of how it held up, but um, you know, maybe I didn't install that right. So I'm gonna give it another chance before I, you know, completely critique it. But I just went in with two layers, waited till it was completely dry. I had sea breezed my forehead before, so I just took sea breeze, took all the excess oils off my head. And made sure that my hair was my hairline my big ass forehead was ready for a wig and that's basically what i'm doing here i'm just blow drying it with my cute little pink blow dryer i didn't have my own blow dryer before this is just so different um but yeah make sure it's completely dry there's there's no white because if there's still white there you did not dry it completely it needs to be completely clear before you put the wig down I've made that mistake a lot of times when I first put the wig on and wonder why <gasps> I wonder why it wasn't sticking correctly. That's because it was still white. Once I feel like I've gotten the, gotten the layers that I wanted down, I start pressing it in. I saw this on, I think, Easy Breezy's channel. And ever since then, I haven't stopped doing it. I don't know if it really makes a difference or not, but like she does it and I trust anything she says. So I was like, yeah, I'm just do that. So that's what I was doing. Then I cut the lace as close to the hairline as I possibly could. Um, and I, I decided to do my wig in parts today, I believe, like, um, oh my gosh, what is my, yeah. if you have it, if you're new here, I have this weird thing where every time I do a voiceover, I yawn for whatever reason, and don't, nobody knows why, and I was no, it just happens every time. Anyways, so, I lost my train of thought, ooh, ooh! um, <laughs> so now I'm just doing the sides, because I try to do the top first, and then go on with the sides after. I haven't been doing the ball cap method lately just because that just takes way too much work. And I don't even keep the wigs on for that long to go through all that work. So as long as you're careful with how you take it off, your edges should be fine. The only reason mine are looking like that is because I literally rip the wig off my head all the time because I'm very easily frustrated. And I don't be having the patience to sit there and, you know, sea breeze the wig off my head. Sea breeze isn't as strong as alcohol and I'm not wasting alcohol on this. <sighs> What's going on right now? So I just use the good old rip it off your head method. That's why my edges are compressed right now. But yours won't be as long as you do it correctly and take it off correctly. I just don't do that because I am very lazy. I don't ever take the time. So as long as you do it correctly, you will not have disappearing edges like me. So now I'm cutting. What am I doing? I'm cutting the lace off my head, like around the perimeter. So I I got this from I think I got this from Seabreeze too. Breeze. Um, easy breezy, um, where she cuts the lace after she already glued it on. 
I can't tell if I like the method yet. Um, I saw somebody else say that you should use like a like a razor instead of uh, scissors. So maybe maybe that's where I messed up. So okay, I guess so I'll try that jumped, like, next time. Crazy, but yeah, I was just cutting it off. And then, oh, like, wait, I'm talking. Like, pause. Uh, I was actually struggling a little bit with putting this lace on. The lace is a little bit dark and I couldn't really blend it that well. Um, and I don't know how to use lace tint. So I just use... Um, Purple shampoo, I use purple shampoo to always try to lighten lace. And I feel like I couldn't light it all the way, lighten it all the way. So I did put baby hairs. Can y'all see? I just added baby hairs, but I've been filming all day. So they probably don't look the greatest. I took way too long to get back to the video after all the stuff I was doing today. But I do like the hair though. The hair is so pretty. This is the color I want all my wigs all the time. This is literally so beautiful. And the hair is really, the hair is really soft. Like I'm about to give y'all some, okay. Hold on. No, like it's giving me very much bad bitch, you know? I feel really pretty in this. I feel like a mermaid. Must go film mermaid POVs on TikTok. But yeah, I really like the hair. Um, I've only had it on for today. Well, actually I installed it the night before. So Technically two days, technically if you want to be technical. But um I really like it so far. It's really nice, it's really soft. I just have conditioner in it. Um I have it with that wet look right now. I just have this conditioner inside. I just have this conditioner in it. Here, watch me catch it without looking. Nope. Watch this. Watch this. I should have done a middle part though. I don't know why I didn't. Okay, I'm done with that. I do really like the hair. Um, I would like to try my stuff from this company because I want to see how they're like black hair. And the curls are really nice. Like these are curls. Like they're not waves. Like look at that. Well, I mean, I guess some of y'all would probably. I guess yeah, they are still waves, but they're really pretty. Like whenever I have six thirteen, in my experience, they're not. The curls don't hold this well. Where's my head? I feel real out of place. I feel like myself again. Um, I think I'm gonna do my good old comeback with more information, but. How I've been managing it is I've just been watering it like a plant. Using the conditioner, I actually don't detangle with the comb. I detangle with my fingers. That looks so awkward. It doesn't really shed. I've only had a little bit of shedding um, whenever I like finger comb, but it's not shedding like any crazy amount. Like it's not like a crazy shedding. I didn't have to tweeze much either. I'm kind of tempted to dye, try to dye it burgundy, but I don't know how that's going to go because it's already colored. It's already 613. So I don't know how that's going to look. I don't know how that's going to go. I don't want to mess it up because I really like this hair. But I just always wanted long burgundy hair, but I think I'm just going to get a different unit for that because this is too pretty. So it's been a few hours since I filmed the last clip and I just wanted to like interject. I'm probably going to put this somewhere in between, but I really like this hair. Like it's completely dried from the conditioner that I put in it. Like I use conditioner for wigs. I don't know if you're supposed to do that or not, but I put conditioner in it and it's so like voluminous. I just came to like update y'all a little bit. I know my smile lines are probably doing a lot, but I'm out. But yeah, I just want to come here and show y'all what the hair looks like right now. Um... My baby hairs literally came off after like a second because I'm a frantic idiot and I sweat too much, so they didn't last long. But um, this is a this is just I I finished the video earlier and like I ended it, so this is just probably gonna be like a cutaway somewhere in between the clip. But yeah, I just was showing y'all the hair and like it's conditioned. It's really soft and it smells really good. It didn't have that like stank. Y'all know that hair smell that wigs get. It didn't have that stank wig smell, that fishy wig smell. I just I just can't. I just can't. But um, I like the fact that they gave me one of those like bags. The where'd it go? It's common or not, but I've never had this besides the other review I did where they gave me like a little soft like satin or silk or whatever that is back. I think that's really cool. I really like when companies do that um, versus leading it in like I'm about to yawn. Ah! Versus giving me versus giving me the wig in like a raggedy ass packaging. I really like that. But yeah, I just came to show y'all the hair after it's like dried. I think it was probably wet in the video. I'm not sure, but yeah. Okay. Um, that's gonna be all though. I really didn't have much to say because the wig is just really nice. It's a really nice unit. I'm gonna link y'all to it. But yeah, like, subscribe, leave comments, turn on notifications, do all that good stuff. And I'll be back.
I'm not gonna say when because I'd be lying. I'll be back soon, okay? I'll be back soon, I promise. Bye.